Growing up in Southern California, obviously surfing and skateboarding was a big part of my childhood and growing up and uh, still skateboard a little bit today, mostly on the surf skates and cruisers. Early mid 80s, I, my grandfather was a carpenter, so I used to always build my own ramps, launch ramps, quarter pipes, half pipes. Uh, I started making ramps when I was like eight or nine years old. A big reason why I have a skull logo is Ray Bones uh, was a skater in my neighborhood, the famous skater in my neighborhood. And my claim to fame when I was like 10, Ray Bones would hit my launch ramps. And you know, as a little kid, you're like, yeah, you were so stoked that he, you know, a celebrity skater like that. And you know, he was the original PAL logo. And that began my obsession with skulls, hence my logo. design process is, like I said, I'm drawn to old classic stuff that kind of stands the test of the time. So that's why I like a lot of my surfboard models. I, when I design them, especially outside of the high performance realm, I try to design a board where, you know, you can have it for 20, 30, 40 years, ride it, give it to your kid, they give it to their, to your grandkids, stuff like that. Something that stands the test of the time and lasts, you know, a long time and try to do the best for quality. Um, that's why I like Yao. I'm just amazed with the quality process here, and you know the the skateboard template designs are pretty simple. Uh, Yao Factory is amazing. It, it exceeded my expectations. I had pretty high expectations, anyways, just from working with Yao for a few years now, and everything's been always top quality. But uh, I was really impressed. Everything's made in house. Uh, they recycle all their waste, all the grip tape excess, all the wood chips, all the extra plastic, every, all the excess material from the, the wheels. It's an it's amazing process. Everything made in-house. Uh, yeah, it was brilliant. <laughs>